More than a century ago, in the misty hills of Assam, a small town called Digboy lit the first flame of India's energy story. When I go to Assam, the first refinery was what, 1901? And where did Digboy come from? Digboy, Dig. And that became the Digboy. I hope we get a refinery called Drill Baby Drill. What began as Asia's first refinery in 1901 has grown into a movement that fuels a nation of 1.4 billion dreams. From those hand-dug wells to today's digital refineries, India's journey has been one of courage, creativity, and constant reinvention. Our refining capacity now stands at about 258 million tons per annum, the fourth largest in the world, and is set to touch 310 million tons per annum by 2030, with a long-term vision of 400 to 450 million tons per annum. And I'm told that as per reports, over 101 of the world's 420 refineries representing nearly 18.4 million barrels per day, about 20% of global capacity, are at risk of closure within the next 7 to 10 years. But the good news is that you've got India. Today, India exports fuels to over 50 countries, worth more than 45 billion US dollars, and sources crude from 40 plus nations, creating one of the most diverse and resilient energy portfolios anywhere. Your consumption is going up. When I joined, our consumption was 5 million barrels a day. Today, it's, I think, 5.6 million barrels a day. I think in the coming uh, couple of quarters, little later, it'll be 6 million barrels a day. If you're looking at 2030, 2050, it's even beyond that. So, consumption is going up. Your technology, your innovation, that is going up. The technology and the production, the in terms of, if you call it indigenization, I think it's about 80% indigenized. The petrochemical intensity index has climbed from 7.7% to 13%, and new systems for biofuel integration, green hydrogen co-processing, and AI-driven digital operations are setting global benchmarks. We are not looking only at India. Today, this is part of a global flow. So I think the overall Indian energy scene looks very promising. From the towers of Digboy to the smart control rooms of today, India's energy heritage continues to shine, rooted in legacy, powered by innovation, under the visionary leadership of Prime Minister Narendra Modi ji.